Meow, meow. It's September 3, and today in Philippine history, Simeon Toribio was born in 1905 in Zamboanga. But I am putting a pin on this because other sources say he was born on August 6 in Bohol. I am still looking for primary documents. Simeon, once called by his playmates Tukon or Stick for being tall and thin, was a Filipino Olympic high jumper. He won a bronze medal in the 1932 Summer Olympics in Los Angeles. He served as the flag bearer for the Philippines at the 1928, 1932, and 1936 Games. From 1921 to 1934, Simeon won five gold medals at the Far Eastern Games, the precursor of the Asian Games. In 1930, he cleared two meters, his personal best. He was the first Filipino high jumper to clear that height. That year, he was awarded the Helms World Trophy and the title Asia's Greatest Athlete. In 1931, he topped the list of the Philippines' Big 12 in amateur sports. Simeon attended Siliman University in Dumaguete. He later became a civil engineer and a lawyer. Simeon served at the Philippine Amateur Athletic Federation after retiring from competition. During the Japanese occupation, he was active in an underground movement as a first lieutenant in Lieutenant Colonel Edwin Price Ramsey's guerrillas operating in Bulacan and Central Luzon. Simeon and his brother Narciso narrowly escaped arrest when a Japanese soldier saw a framed scroll presented to him by the Japanese emperor during the Far Eastern Games. It was also the emperor's birthday, so they were never taken by the Kempetai. Simeon served as a congressional representative for the province of Bohol from 1941 to 1953. He passed away on June 5, 1969 at 63 in Carmen, Bohol. In Jorge Afable's Philippine Sports Greats, he was described as a very disciplined man who knew how to excel at a full-time job and at sports with a no-nonsense athletics training regimen. Sana all. Oh, diba? 